I came here expecting this to be a normal explore like I'd done a hundred times before. I soon realised this was no ordinary house. Okay explorers, so we are inside this huge abandoned mansion right now. We are going to have a good look around. This place looks absolutely amazing, proper dated, so much is left behind and just such amazing architecture. So we're going to have a good look around and if we catch any vibes, you know what we're going to do? We're going to have a little investigation, but this place is just amazing as it is. Just check out this main entrance dining hall. So much of the old original furniture still in here. Check this out guys. All hand carved benches, pews on the wall, all carved designs. This is just your main entrance now as well. Check this out, the huge dining room table just looks absolutely amazing in this light. And the big chandelier up top. But you can see all the carvings in the, in the chairs up on the walls here as well absolutely amazing look at this bookshelf wow all the marble floor as well just looks absolutely amazing in this light and then the, all the carved ceilings what a beautiful room but there is so much to see in here. This is just the first room, guys. This is just your main entrance. There is house, it's absolutely huge. So we are just gonna keep moving and see as much as we can. Once again, another amazing room. Chandelier. Check out the ceiling rows with the cherubs. Chaiselong. We've got another table in here as well. We got some furniture as well. But just check out that architecture around the top there. And then the nice chandelier just to set it off. The shutters on the windows, absolutely beautiful. And then once again, all amazing wooden furniture. See the family in these old photographs. That looks like the family tree there. These are all probably taken in this house. Nice Victorian era there. Look at this though, the ceiling, the chandelier. Beautiful, what a beautiful home. The people that lived here, I'm assuming this gentleman at one time, must have had so much money. Strange little single bed in here too. Like I said, the house is huge. We are gonna have to just push forward to see as much as we physically can. Got all the cobwebs covering this door. The Javi, absolutely vile. Wow. These rooms are just beautiful, guys. The glasses in this cupboard there. The cabinet. 
flowers still sitting on the side here. I think this is the same gentleman from the other room. Definitely the ancestors of the owners. It's quite dark, guys. You'll have to forgive me, but look at this fireplace. Stunning, absolutely stunning. Looks like a reading room. Fireplaces fell apart here though. Natural decay just starting to kick in. The armchairs there. How nice is this? Definite vibes in this house. 100%. Just moving into the kitchen here. Like the table, didn't they? The table in every single room. Cross on the wall. Standard. But we've still got the utensils for cooking here. Nice big double sinks. There is just so much left. And the nice oven. What are we thinking so far, guys? The house just, just go on forever. Absolutely humongous. Wow. Check these cupboards, there are these fridges. Are these old fridges? Yeah, it looks like. How cool are them? They look like something out of a morgue. I wouldn't want them in my house. Is that like another old freezer? Yeah. So this would have been a freezer. Or a pantry. Absolutely crazy. Cobwebs in my face and everything. What are you saying so far guys? The place is beautiful. Definitely one of the biggest mansions we've explored on the channel. I'd say it's got a hell of an age to it. But we are going to head upstairs now and check out what's up there. Wow. Hopefully more of the same. And then we are going to, I think, do a little necrophonic session. Hopefully we'll pick something up because this place is absolute vibes. Okay, explorers, we're just heading up these old stone stairs. Curving round, you can see the banisters, all old, iron there. Not sure what that noise was. But we'll head into this room. the wind. I hope it was the wind. Oh, none of these doors are shut. Check this out guys. How amazing is this? Every single room is just absolutely beautiful architecture. Classic Italian style. Just moving into these bedrooms now. Quite small, considering the size of the house, what I was expecting. Looks like the family members. Yeah, I think this guy was definitely a head figure of the family. He's in every, nearly every room. Oh, that's well put me on edge, that door. Okay, let's regroup. <laughs> okay, let's regroup. <laughs> okay. Let's regroup. <laughs> right, just keep looking. Oh, a proper haunting corridor. We'll check that out in a sec. Let's have a look around here first. Wow. Right, that door's not moving. Wow. 
this bad dream guys how amazing is this the double beds there same fella again in the picture Fireplaces are just stunning, even the fire guard. Look at that. For some reason there's a chair in front of this. It looks like a nice office table there. More of the beds. Can you believe that this is just somebody's home? Is everywhere. I'm freaking out, guys. Little bathroom here. Check this out. It's nice. Nice size bathroom. A bidet there. We love a bidet. Never actually used one, though. It's quite dark in these rooms. Oh. How cheeky is that? You've got another bathroom right next to it. His and hers. Wow. Right, I think this ends back in that other room. Yep. So that was the scary corridor. <laughs> Did actually freak me out, I'm not gonna lie. Oh wow. You know when you just see these uh, old houses on horror films like House in the Haunting Hill and stuff like that, this is just... This is just exactly the same man. It's terrifying. It's alright people going, oh yeah, I'd explore that. Yeah, but would you... Would you come on your own? That's the question. Please tell me this camera's picking up these noises. Wow. Check out this dresser here. Female on the front there. This guy appears in every single room, so I'm guessing he's definitely like the head of the family or well-known figure in the community because he's in every single room no matter what or who else uh, what no matter what is in the room there's a picture of that guy in there is that making sense check this out another bathroom this is definitely going to call for a necrophonic session this place is freaking me out. Oh my god, how many bathrooms do you need? That's ridiculous. There are some photos on there though. Oh wow. Check them out guys. Don't know why they're in the sink, but here we are. There is still another floor to explore, so we will head up there as well. But look at the decay in this part. Oh my god, another door's just banged. Right, this is probably the scariest house I've ever explored. I'm not gonna lie. Right, we're gonna check out this last floor, all the decay on the floor here. Right, gonna have to be careful. Cobwebs up the banister there. House is so beautiful though. Even though it's scary and freaky. Oh wow, look at this guys. Look at the size of these rooms. Oh, you can... Oh, it's only a bit of a doll, it's all right. Don't know who this lady is here.
that there is like personal belongings in these cupboards still. Oh wow. Check this room out guys. Looks like a child's room with the single bed. Oh of course. Of course there is. There's always a doll, isn't there? I'm haunted by dolls, guys. Look at this room though. Such vibes. So this looks like a child's room. If you look out the window here, check out the views. Absolutely beautiful. Let's check out this cupboard here as well. I think there's some rooms that go down here as well. Yeah, we'll look at that. But we've got all bed pans and stuff in here. The house just goes on forever. Oh wow. Another bed there. With some little chap. Just chilling there. Let's have a look out the back. Look at this guys, how beautiful is that? As the birds just flew away. Absolutely amazing though. All the way through the home you can see this marble floor. And then more single beds. I don't think we've seen like a master bedroom, have we? I don't think. I am hearing things around this house, guys. It is freaking me out. Let's make sure this torch doesn't run out. Otherwise we'll be knackered for light. Oh, looks like all the attic's falling through here. above the stairs that's a, got a dodgy step look at this Can someone let me know what that would be used for just in this hallway what that is guys. Got a little bedding in these uh, crates here. That heads upstairs but we're not going to go upstairs because look at it completely falling through there. Totally not worth dying. You can see there the attic falling through. But how amazing is this guys? This is 100% one of the creepiest places I've ever explored. The vibes in this place are off the charts. I'm literally hearing bumps and bangs, doors slamming. Little bits of rubble falling as I'm walking around. fell on this floor somewhere. Not sure whereabouts. But this is freaking me out. What's down here? No. This is the freakiest house I've ever been in. 100%.
Right, let's get our bearings to where we are. And we'll do a, I left that door open. I left that door open. What is going on? Wonder if it's one of these people playing with me. But something is in this house. Summit is in this house, 100%. The longer I stayed in the house, the more the atmosphere felt like it was changing. I felt like whoever was in the house with me was playing with me. Maybe they wanted me to leave, maybe they just wanted to scare me, or maybe they had a message. As much as I wanted to leave, I needed to find out. Okay, explorers, just setting up the necrophonic now. Just gonna give it a little whiz. I've heard so many bumps and bangs in this place that I've got to do it. I've 100% got to try this. Um, so we're just gonna shout out some questions and see if we get any responses that are relevant. And hopefully we do. Right, let's start. Can you tell me if there's any spirits in this house that would like to talk to me? Is there anyone that would like to contact me or have a message? Go. Go. Can you tell me how many spirits are in this house? I don't mean to do you any harm, I just want to know if anyone's here, if anyone's got a message. Are you the gentleman in the photos dotted around the home? Leave. Have you been following me around the house? I've heard some bumps and bangs. Is that you? Do you want me to be in here? Or would you like me to leave? Can you say into the device? Mosquitoes. Can you hear a ch child voice? Is there any children that are stuck in this home? Can you tell me if I'm in any danger being in here? Leave straight away. Can you, can you make another bang for me? Yes. I know you've made a few already, can you just do one more? How many spirits are in this house? Tell me clearly now. <laughs> Sorry about that. Would you like me to leave? Would you like me to leave? Say into the device now. Don't mean any harm, I am just come to explore and... Would you like me to leave? Go. Come on. Give me a good answer. No. No. What the hell is that? Something coming from down there. <gasps> I thought I turned that off. 
Oh, Necrophone, it's going mad in my pocket. I turned it off. Right, it's off. Right, I heard a bang down here. Let's go check it out. Hello? I'm sure it came from here. 100%. It was behind me. Hello? Is there anyone here? Is there any spirits here? Do you want to make a bang? Let me know that you're here. Come on. Is that the gentleman? Is the gentleman in this picture still here? Can you make a noise, a bang? Come on. Don't be shy. Definitely doesn't want me here anymore, guys. I can't wait to go through that necrophonic. There were some brilliant answers on there. What we're gonna do now, guys, is there's a whole load of outbuildings. I wanna go outside and check them. Yeah, I wanna go outside and check them and see what we can find. Let's do this. Okay, explorers, we are back outside. That house gave me the bloody willies, I'm telling you. Not to be messed with, that is definitely one of the creepiest houses I've ever been in. But we're just outside and we're just gonna look at some of the features of the house. This place is absolutely amazing. Look at this, all stuff like this. So there's your water pump. So there should be, yeah, a well around here. How cool is this? I love stuff like this, guys. It's been filled in, or it's not a well, I'm not sure. But we are just gonna have a look around, guys. Look at all these outbuildings over here. Looks like a, a bloody fortress. But you can see the outside now. This place is absolutely massive. All wildlife, all overgrown out here. It's stunning. That house has full on freaked me out. I'm not even gonna lie. It's a beautiful house, but that's definitely one of the most haunted places I've ever been in my life. 100%. But if you check this, it's got like a separate courtyard. How cool is this? Look at this guys, how amazing. All this is on the land. All comes with it. I'm not sure if it's used this part, you know. It does look it. Oh, it's like 40 degrees. That's probably not hot for you guys, but I'm from UK. We're, we're, we're sweating at 24 degrees. Look at this house though, guys. Look at this. How amazing. Creepy as, but amazing. And I'm just gonna head out to this outbuilding here because it's got quite a lot of detail on it. And it does look pretty amazing. Oh cool, like an old stables. Check this out guys. Oh, there's cobwebs in my face, there's flies everywhere. Wouldn't be surprised if something's dead in here. Not sure what that is, some sort of torture, BDSM. Malarkey. But everywhere you go, you get cobwebs in the face, or a lizard running at you. It's, it's insane, this place. What a beautiful bit of land as well that goes with the house. But let's uh, head over, check out that chapel, see if we can get in. Salus Infirmarin. Infirmarin. Don't know. But check this out, it has its own chapel here wow look at this family members palotti with jesus on the wall there look at this ceiling guys and the architecture on the roof so i'm guessing this is a a crypt maybe underneath here the family would be buried here. That's probably why you're getting so much activity in the house. That does explain it. More family members' names up on the wall here. Look at the candles. 
on that cross so that cross would lower down and you'd uh, light all the candles and raise it back up that's insane i've never seen that before but we have 12 family members that are possibly buried underneath here oh that was loud let's have a look through wow i've never seen anything like this this is straight out of a horror film guys isn't it not even lying there will be a crypt here what's this for then can anyone let me know it's like a viewing gallery there's a cross on the wall over there wow is that for this door here yeah i've never seen anything like this before not in somebody's house i'm just trying to work out if there'd be a way down into the crypt there usually will be or it's been uh, buried over it's been filled in there is a bit of a glass floor in here so maybe it's under there but how insane is this the date 1892 um 1901 19 so they go back 1892 is the earliest unless it's these roman numerals oh 1881 wow imagine this your whole family just buried here look guys a family tree wow this is insane this is absolutely insane guys i've never seen anything like this in somebody's garden a mausoleum that's what i was trying to say not a crypt a mausoleum for the family that are still haunting that house this is insane okay explorers what a perfect way to finish it from outside the family's mausoleum hidden in the garden back here uh, what an amazing house complete time capsule going back hundreds of years so many original features still in there and um, the architecture the beds tables it's absolutely amazing it's one time capture wise one of my favorite for activity rubble falling when nobody's there footsteps doors banging i'll have to go through the uh, necrophonic when editing to see if we've picked up anything there but i'm pretty sure there were some clear answers what an amazing place and to think the family is still buried under this chapel anyway guys hope you've enjoyed that one of the most haunted houses I've ever seen. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Hit notification for future explores. This has been amazing. I hope you've enjoyed it. And we'll see you next week. Cheers, guys.